In the year 3000, humans will change from this to this. In this video, we're going to look at how this will happen. In the future, around the year 3000, human will change. This company made a 3D model of how the human would look like in the year 3000. They called it this person, Mindy. Mindy will have a hunched back, will have a text claw, will have a tech neck, and probably will have a smaller brain and thicker skull. Those things are very important for the neurosurgeons because we deal with the brain and spine. Let's see how this would happen. As we continuously look at more screens and mobile phones, there will be more and more pressure on our neck. This will mean in the year 3000s, our neck is going to have to do a lot more work and be under a lot of strain. In 2020, in America, adults were spending approximately 7 hours and 50 minutes a day on screen time or devices. In the year 2020, this is going to be thought to go up to over 8 hours a day. When you bend your neck forward, or beyond 60 degrees, surprisingly this can put up to 30 kilos of pressure on your neck. We think in the year 3000, 100% of people will be experiencing neck pain from using devices so much during the day. This means there's going to be a lot more neck and degenerative disease in people's spine in the future. And unfortunately, we also think that the people affected will become younger and younger than today's population. Humans in the year 3000 would have a text claw. And a claw means a curled fingers. And as you would expect, this would happen because us holding the phone for long times every day. Because of the repetitive movement of the fingers and the rest joints, that will lead to pain and excessive strain on the muscles and the ligaments in the hand and the rest. That will cause a lot of inflammation and the pain around these joints and in the longer term that can exacerbate underlying problems in the hand. The one of interest to the neurosurgeons something called carpal tunnel syndrome. Carpal tunnel syndrome is basically thickening of the ligaments in the rest which will lead to more compression of the nerves that passes through the rest to the hand. That will lead to severe pain and the extreme uh, case scenarios that can lead to weakness in your arms and your hands. In the extreme form of that, that can lead to weakness in the muscles of your hand. Over the past 20,000 years, strangely, human brains have become smaller and our skulls have become a bit thicker. Now, a team of researchers looked into why this is and came up with some pretty weird and surprising conclusions for the year 3000. This is because with the passage of time, we're having to use our brains less and less to do activities of daily living thanks to technology. However, this is going to affect our bodies in many ways, including our brain and our skull. Another thought was from a paper from the World Health Organization who wrote in 2011 that radio frequency devices like your mobile phone could be a potential risk of causing cancer. Now, it may be that as more and more radio frequencies are flying around, our skulls become thicker to protect us. So in the year 3000, is a human going to be smarter or dumber than we are now? If we hibernated you and you woke up then, maybe you'd be a genius like Officer Mark in the film Idiocracy. We used an artificial intelligence tool and asked it to provide a picture for us in the year 3000. And here are the results. Please let us know in the comments below what do you think of these results? Picture of a human in the year 3000. Of us, you know, it's, okay. it's, 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 it's like, us as humans, okay. okay. Finally, technology is very helpful and it will be helping us even more in the future. But it can also be very harmful as you can see. So please keep an eye on yourself and also limit your time on the screen. Not only your time, but also your kids' time. Keep fit and well and healthy and do exercise as much as you can do because we don't want to see you in our clinics. Stay tuned for our next video.